my goodness, guys. Welcome to the D Diaries. Today we're going to talk about my family. Ah! Well, hello, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So this weekend, I'm going to be taking you on a fun journey of love. So we are going to be heading over to my grandparents' farm in the little town that my mom grew up in, and we're going to be celebrating my grandparents' 60th wedding anniversary. That's right, six zero wedding anniversary. They have been married for 60 years. You don't really see a lot of anymore and so i'm i'm really excited to celebrate with them and celebrate with the family and kind of you know just get to spend time with everybody and especially um the party we're throwing we're throwing a very fabulous party for them where we have like balloons we have flowers we have this giant sequins backdrop that's going to be used for photos like it's we we really went out like we really showed out. I'm really excited and it's definitely going to be such a fun time. So here we go. Okay, so a couple things. Basically, I did not know this, but the 60th wedding anniversary flower is the orchid. So we got them this beautiful orchid and then I went to the dime store and got a Diana Barnes vase. And what's really cool about this one, is it has a flat back so you can see flat back and then two little hooks so if she wants to hang this or even just like use the pot for something different she totally can and i just think it's so fun and who would have thought and i never knew that the flower was an orchid definitely really excited for that and i can't wait to kind of see what she thinks also i'm really concerned about taking care of said orchid um are kind of tricky but I don't know. So we left the little like care instructions on it. So hopefully it, it, let, it lives a long life. We've pa I've packed up all my stuff and you know, I'm gonna be taking you guys with me. So definitely really excited. This is my first vlog since like pre, pre COVID, mid COVID. I don't know. Um, I haven't done like a full-blown Denton vlog in a really long time, so I am really excited to be just taking you guys on this journey with me and this weekend getaway, and it's gonna be so much fun. I can't wait for you guys to see it. So of course I have to show the travel fit. So let's make sure we're in focus. So we are traveling today in a lovely Bella doll button down that I thrifted. I do need to fix something on the back though because um, it is kind of ripped, but that's fine. I can I can fix that easy. And I'm trying out, y'all get this, I'm trying out the Spanx pleather leggings. So, so far I'm like thoroughly impressed and a lot of the reviews I've read that they are definitely um, tight and like conforming to your body, but I ordered a large petite. So the lengthwise, they're great, but I probably could have gone for a medium petite and been okay, but I'm I'm glad I like went with a large. So but yeah, they they're they're really comfy. Like I can like wiggle and stuff, and like I know I'm gonna be super comfy on the car ride there. And then of course just some white sneakers. Yo, you gotta you gotta keep it classic sometimes. So yeah. This is the travel fit, and of course we got the crossbody bag. So I've already heard that um, we have to make a Walmart run, which naturally always happens. So I'll make a Walmart run before we run off to the farm. Now we're buying more things we don't need for the party, but that's fine. That's fine. See, I now, bad that some of the other pictures didn't, didn't Oh, these are cute. Oh, as I dropped, so it's a banner. But our photos are all five, are four by six. Six. Oh, never mind. Those are cute though. I have okay. tea lights. I got tea lights and we can put them in here if we want to put them in the little white things, like maybe get five and just like every other table. That's that to go the lid. Oh, oh. Well, we're going to have those centerpieces though. Yeah, I know, but you put these around the centerpieces. Oh. Oh. I don't know either. We're just, we're making decisions. <laughs> okay. After 60 years, she said yes. Okay, price is right. 80 bucks, $80. Uh, 
nope, I'm gonna go maybe 105. 105? Price is right, mom. How much you think? Uh, 95? 95? 95? 95? Okay, okay, okay. We've got, we've got a good spread, we've got a good spread. Oh no, it's gonna be close to 120. What did I say, 90? Oh, I you said, said 80 I said 80 something. Yeah, no, it's not gonna be 80 something. I already lost. No, they won't. These weren't that expensive, were they? Yeah. I'm out. Oh, I'm out. Yeah, <laughs> oh, Jewel, you're gonna be right on. Hundred? Hundred forty. Jewel got it. <laughs> All right. Have some of the queso. The dairy will help. Exactly. What they need. She can't do that. Ow! So a uh, flower fell off of the plant. It made it all the way to its destination and then it fell off. Come on. We have the balloon arch. Now it's time to now it's time to blow up a million balloons. We have mom over there steaming. Jules getting balloons. More balloons. More balloons. I think all we have is this bag. So. Alright, well, you do that. I'm gonna go ahead and start blowing up. The yeah. Yeah. So, I've never actually made a balloon arch. I've thought about it. I've never actually made it. Ooh, what's that for? Wait, did this. Okay, there's tape. And then there's this thing. Is there. There's no instructions! Oh. How to make a baby merch. We figured it out. Students! We're done. It's 20 minutes till midnight. Mm -hmm. The balloon arch has fallen three times. We'll figure it out. So I need to paint my nails. And naturally, I brought the Love and June travel kit. So there's everything. And Jill brought hers too. We're going to have a nail party. Emma the cat. Oh, it's a baby cat. Okay, bye. Okay, yeah, because we've been doing batteries, these double A batteries at home. Uh, that works for the dog. I'm tired. But we're going to do this. You have an aggressive family without telling me you have an aggressive family. Is it before or after Netflix? Uh, before. before. To my ginger. For 60 years, we have journeyed together. Not always easy, but full of love and great memories. Like camping with our kids, going to ranger ball games with you, watching Dirk with the b-ball running in the rain, visits to Dallas Arboretum, and going to the fair with you. But I guess we will not be eating corny dogs at the fair this year. Uh, your craft ideas astonish me, my flower girl. I am so proud of your skills at the piano, and your cooking is amazing. I want you to know that my heart would be empty without your love, and my life would be dark without the love and life you bring to my life. I love you with all that I am, and if given the choice, I would do it all over again and again. <laughs> I remember meeting you at the Elbert Long School. I know that you did not remember me, but I will never forget the beautiful girl in a yellow dress with a ducktail hair. I had no idea that I would ever have the chance to fall in love with her. I will always cherish our times growing up growing in love with each other. I will always remember and never forget our firstborn son, our secondborn son, and finally a lovely girl. All of those you bore for me. I'm sure you can never forget those blessed events as evidenced by the stretch marks. Boy, did those little ones change our lives. Not everyone can be so proud. I hope that you have not been too displeased with me for all the 
all those times I failed to carry out the garbage, pick up my clothes, conceal your feelings by forgetting to tell you where I was going or what I was fixing to do. I could not have made it this far without you doing it. I do still love you very much. Happy anniversary, my, my love, on our 60th anniversary of love. Couple of questions. So, so how much was a gallon of gas? And how many years were you married before you bought your first house? And how much was your first house, you know? $14,000. Boy, I wish! Just paid two fifty-eight. I just bought a car for $28,000. You mean the horse and buggy? No. <laughs> it was the old gray bomb. The old gray bomb. So did y'all all learn to live on, or drive on the old gray bomb? Uh, yeah, probably the old gray bomb. See, we, we had a, a, a Datsun station wagon. Uh, that, that when Dad bought it brand new, he goes, everybody's going to learn to drive in this car. And we're like going, yeah, well, whatever. But we did. All three of us. Everybody <laughs> drive in that car. What about uh, a loaf of bread and a gallon of milk and a dozen eggs? I have no idea. Oh, the Bible? <laughs> and the milk. The, the original curbside delivery, sir? Yeah. So, so it wasn't like three dollars a gallon for milk back then. Oh no, oh no. But you didn't have your own cow in the back. <laughs> oh, no. That's what so my grandma used to. Go, well, your grandpa and I, we just had a cow and some beans and covered wagon. As we can tell from from our letter here, that your love has increased too. We thank you again for your example and your encouragement and your challenge to us to follow in your footsteps. So we love you. Thank you, and I'm going to pray for them real quick, and then we'll get back to the My family, I don't know where they went. Out of there. Now we're outside. Oh my gosh, the ground is soggy. She's out here. She's the girl. You need the hat. Oh, okay. You need the hat. <laughs> you need the hat, and I actually need this on. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm ready. I've been ready. I've been recording. Awesome. Oh my goodness, guys. Welcome to the D Diaries. Today we're going to talk about my family. Ah! Ooh, woo. <laughs> So we got the bright idea to put the candles in these mason jars without actually thinking how to get said candle wax out of mason jars. So now we're playing with boiling water. But this one's working, so I can get that one up yeah. now if you want. But that one's working now. Yeah. So we need like a tongue. like a tongy thing. Honestly, I was thinking of just like throwing it through the strainer. Yeah, you can do that. There we go. I'll, I'll have you be on my yeah. There we go. Oh. You got any more? Oh yeah, those are all done. They all need to be strained. Say goodbye, wax. Oh. 
Well, not before we finish this. I did, there is plenty to eat, so I didn't know if we wanted to eat dinner here before we go. This one broke. The glass? Yeah. I think it too, and the trash here. Um. <clears throat> Where's the strainer? I... jars are not they don't like us we already broke the little one. jars don't like us they um oh my gosh look at it it's just a clean uh -huh. okay well <laughs> we have chickens guineas Chickens, guineas, feathers, and ponies. Ponies! Oh, we're being the pony. Is this Misty? Mm -hmm. <gasps> Misty. Good. Oh, these are such good food. Nom noms. Yeah, Cody's over there. What? <laughs> oh yeah. Rihanna's got the good stuff. Oh, say hi! Aside from my soul.